Real versus counterfeit. Real versus fake. Um, just to review, um, the packaging. Um, this is actually, the real packaging is a little thinner and actually a more cheaper quality, surprisingly. Um, the counterfeit, the packaging is just a little bit thicker and it also came with a sticker. The casing, the counterfeit, which is above, uh, came in a clear, cheaper, mass-produced case. Um, the real one, not so clear, a lot stronger, sturdier, feels like it'll last a lot longer. Um, when you first open the DVD case, other than um, the coloring, the change in coloring with the case, all of the whole, both cases are definitely uh, different shades. Um, the main characters are a lot tanner in the real version and not so tan in the counterfeit, which is now on the right. Um, and also the black is not black. It's a lot more of a red shade. Um, the first thing you notice when you open up the actual packaging is that there's no DVD on the left. Um, the DVDs, um, the counterfeit, they're a lot smoother. They're printed differently. Um, they still got the shine, but they have no texture. The real DVDs, surprisingly, are rigid. Um, I'm going to go take a look at one of the DVDs. So I wasn't expecting the DVDs to actually look the same. Uh, very shiny, um, but the difference between the real version, the actual official release, is that they're rigid. Um, they feel rigid and you can actually see the ridges in the DVDs. Um, again, not only is the packaging different, but the way they um, lay out all the DVDs is different. Um, there's not a DVD in the front. Not a DVD in the front. Um, there's one DVD for per side. Um, unlike the counterfeit, which has two DVDs on the last uh, part of the casing. So, you know, I mean, they, they, they try to copy as best they can. This is Castle of the Complete Fourth Season Counterfeit vs. Official Release. The following is a live unpackaging of Castle of the Complete Fourth Season 